Let's have a look at the Dome 9 provider in Terraform. We define the Dome 9 resources in a Terraform file. Here we've added resources to onboard an AWS account. Here are the details for it. Let's run the file and see what happens. It's done now. The account resource in Terraform was successfully created. This represents the AWS account that was onboarded to Dome 9. Now, let's have a look at the Dome 9 app. Let's check the cloud inventory, and here it is, the account we onboarded from Terraform. Opening it up, we can see the details for the regions, just as we specified in the Terraform file. Notice, all the regions are read-only. Now, let's go back to the Terraform file and change one of the regions to full manage, and rerun the file. Terraform is state-based, so it picks up the changes and applies them. In this case, it will perform an account update, rather than onboard, since the account is already onboard. Now it completed and shows one change. Let's look at the cloud inventory on Do9 again, and notice the region has changed. Finally, let's go back to Terraform and destroy the resources we created. This should remove the account from Do9. The action is completed. Back to Dome 9 and notice the account is gone. 